Welcome, I'm Joshi, and in this playthrough of Marvel Champions, we have Hulk versus Collector. This is Collector 1, so this is the one that involves the uh, collection stage. We are playing Hulk and Protection again, if you saw my last video. Uh, I was also playing this build with Hulk. Uh, it didn't get much of a chance to shine based on how that game went, so I thought let's give it another try against our next opponent. So looking at the setup, we create the collection game area, so we're just going to use the environment as our collection area. Uh, so we put the top card of each player's deck face up into collection. So firstly, we have a preemptive strike going to collection. We we'll advance to 1B. So this comes in before threat per player. Goes up one each round and threats out at 10. There's a hero action we can choose to either exhaust our hero or spend two resources of any type, and we discard one card from the collection to the uh, discard pile. We have the collector who schemes for two, attack one, health of 13 on stage one. Is a force to interrupt when a card or encounter uh, card, like a player card or encounter card, would be placed into a discard pile from play, it goes face up into collection instead. Yeah, if we um, get five cards in the collection, we'll lose the game. So, with that, let's uh, drop a hand size of five. We have Hulk Smash, Queen Carrier, uh, Night Nurse, Unflappable, and a Limitless Strength. Use all right. I think I think we know what we're, we're doing off the bat then. Um, uh, do we experimental research? No, we'll flip up into Hulk. We're going to use limitless strength for three resources, put in the Quinn carrier since we're an Avenger. So playing of our den has adventure trait, we can exhaust the Queen Carrier during our wild resource. We will then spend one, two, three resources for Hulk Smash. And we'll smack the collector for 13. Taking it straight to stage two. As we often do. Uh, so collector comes in with a scheme of three, attack of two, when revealed in play order, each player must choose to either put the top card uh, of their deck face up into the collection or take three damage. We'll just take the three damage. And the collector now has 14 hit points. And he's got the same interrupt. A card uh, gets discovered from play, goes into collection. Ready up. We'll draw four cards. We have strength. Unstoppable Force, a Sidestep, and a Crushing Blow. Okay. All right, we get one threat on the main scheme. The Collector is going to attack us. We'll just take it. So he's going for two plus nothing. We'll get our encounter card. And it's our obligation. All right, so we flip to Bruce Banner. We we'll discard two cards from our hand. Uh, well, we'll get rid of Sidestep and the Crushing Blow, I guess. Yeah. All right. So our turn, we'll use Experimental Research to draw a card, discard a card, bring to Strike. We don't want that. We'll flip up to Hulk. We'll attack for three. Then collect it down to 11. We'll spend two physical resources to ready Hulk. If you pay for this using only physical resources, we draw a card. Draw a card. Nerves of Steel. That's unfortunate. Um, right, so we'll attack for three. Take collect down to eight. Uh, then we'll just spend two resources to bring Preemptive Strike out of the collection. And then we're ready. We'll draw four cards. A Suborbital Leap, Energy, Electrostatic Armor, and an Armored Vest. Okay, we get one threat on here. Collector is going to attack us for base two. We'll take it. Two plus nothing again. Another servant bot. Encounter card. Philosopher's Stone. Uh, so this comes in putting a 
amplify icon in play. Collect will hit us for three now. Comes with three threat plus hinder two per player, so that's going to be five all up. And when defeated, the player who defeated this game may draw two cards. That's kind of nice. But I think we are going to spend we're going to spend three resources for suborbital leap. And here comes Mixy. Almost destroying my game table. Uh, Sub all leap, three resources. They weren't all physical, so we can just aim with three threat. We're going to take it off the main scheme. We'll use our Queen Carry to put an armored vest, giving us an extra defense. Then we'll attack for three. They can collect it down to five. And then we're ready. And we'll draw four cards. We have Print of Strike, Banner's Lab, Ironheart, and Hard to Ignore. Okay. We get one throughout the main scheme. Collector is attacking us for two. We'll take it. Oh, sorry, two, three all up. Plus uh, one. You know, we will. We'll spend a resource. It's not really worth it, but we'll do it because we want to try and get damage on the board. Uh, spend a resource to... Actually, it will be worth it if this all works out. Uh, Preemptive Strike. Defense. When a boost card is turned face up while a villain attacks, we cancel all boost icons on that card, then deal one damage to the villain for each boost icon cancelled this way. So we cancel the one. One goes back on him, and he's just going to hit us for the three. Then get our encounter card. Sonic Ghost, when revealed, you are confused. If you're already confused, take one damage. That's fine. We'll get confused. Because then we will Quinn Carrier and Hard to Ignore to bring in Ironheart. Uh, after you play Ironheart from your hand, draw one card. We have a Thunderclap. It's not really going to matter. The Sonic Ghost does not have guards, so Ironheart's just going to attack for one. Taking one consequential damage. Hulk. Tax for three. And that'll defeat Collector 1. So, Hulk, strongest one there is. Uh, another quick game with the protection deck. Again, wasn't my intention, but it just sort of went that way. Uh, idea was to get like resource generators down and get things like hard to ignore and control threat and whatnot. But uh, once again, I don't pilot Hulk. Hulk pilots me. So, I hope you enjoyed this game. <laughs> much quicker than I anticipated. I'm sure the next game when we go up against Collector 2 is going to be a whole different story. Uh, so if you like this content, uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.